everybody it's adam again welcome to ba back to my channel but before we get started hit the like button and subscribe today we're going to be learning how to make a game so as you may know i love geometry dash we played it on the channel but there's one problem with geometry dash it is too hard like i had a lot of attempts in order to beat like like a level so that's why we're gonna be make our own geometry dash it's gonna be of course easier than the uh, actual geometry dash and in the series in this series what we're gonna be doing is in like like learn programming and scratch and in g develop so why i'm doing this series is because on the on i have on school I have like have a little project with the principal to like introduce programming to people on my school but to then they can like learn how to do it and uh, here's the thing I am also learning they're learning I'm learning you're of course learning because you're watching this video everybody's learning so now we're going to begin with making a game so First, what we're gonna do is delete the cats. Bye, cats. Okay. Now, make paint a sprite. Then, what we'll be doing is making a sprite. Yeah, a sprite is like an object in the thing, and the name of our game will be B dash. That's the name. So let's go and make character so it's like that the filling will be nothing for now go like this square put it up oh, no 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 okay now let's go there let's move him to the center of the screen he's a little bit too big so let's change the size to uh, 58 now yeah got our object now let's make another like an eye so let's make an eye so make it bigger to 10 maybe oh that's good that and we will let's go here and press that copy paste paste and now we've got another one and we'll bring this guy to the other side now we've got two yeah and now we just act like this and like this yeah well like this so he's like happy yeah we've got our guy now let's make him like that the name of our of our mascot of this like youtube channel his name is buzzy and we're making him now so we've got like one eye like a bee has more than one eye so make it like here no that that's like a that's not like a mustache we don't want that <laughs> like one line is also good then let's fill it up with the yellow and let's make it a little bit brighter Fill it up. Yeah, that's our character. Let's code it. Wait, forgot about that. We need a ground now. So paint. Now we're going to make a ground. So block. Black. So we've got a block. That. Uh, let's set the size to 40. That's a good size. Let's place it here. And now let's add like on the sides it will have like a different color so like blue that type of blue is good and this is like cooler the so white's like boring black block down there and then we've got like that yeah that's our block so here zoom and like scroll out 
Bats and then like duplicate him. Okay, and we'll copy and paste. So now it's like that. Oh, oh no, wait, what? Why is there a second thing? What's that one doing? Oh, it's the. Uh, I forgot about that. Yeah. But here it's total thing. So now it's just like that. And uh, again, we'll duplicate that again. Oh yeah, copy, copy, paste. And that one. Be all the way over there. And you could just repeat the cycle. But then we've got this thing. But that's the problem. It's, yeah. You can see that. It's uh, it's not long enough, so uh, we have to duplicate the sprite. I've got a second one, and we place it over there. Now, yeah, now we place our sprite B here. Now, this is where it begins with the programming. When Green Flag clicked, what we wanted to do is he jumps. But first, he needs to go over there. We don't want him to go, like, here or somewhere, or there, 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 you know what I mean? So, place him there. Go, so, here says, go to that position. So, you can see when we move, when we change the direction, you can see that it also changes. So, yeah. Okay, so go to that position, yeah. What we want then is, yeah, that's it. So that's the first one. Then when green flag click again, then if the space key is pressed, what do we want? We want them to jump, of course. So then, we could do is repeat 10 times, we put inside of the motion calculator, change y by 10, then duplicate that, but then negative, negative. So then we put a negative 10, so now we've got that. So if we have the beginning of C, see that it does, it's like, it doesn't work. Why does it not work? We forgot to be but forever. Why? W but then, like, you would think, wait, so what? It says forever, so when you press one time, it would go forever. You think that, but no. Forever actually means, it's like, keep, it's forever checking if the space key is pressed. So it will check forever if the space key is pressed. So now, now it works now we're jumping now the next one is the spikes in most games you're not moving the objects are moving and it looks like that you're moving so that's why we're gonna make a triangle so yeah lines black like that like that and like that set size Small, of course, so 30 maybe ish. You could choose that's that's a good thing, yeah. I like that. Then we'll fill it in with black, so then fill it in with black, fill it in with black, and now what we'll do is bring it back to blue ish. So like it's the same color, but then put it back to lines. Oh, pff, wrong thing. <laughs> Undo. I meant like this one needs to be like the bluish. Yeah, that's it. And we put like that, like that. So it's cooler. Yeah, that's it. I got to code. So, uh, when Grief had clicked, what we want is him to move from here 
chill to the other side, but not too fast, of course. Left placing over here and like up like that. Yeah. So then it looks like that he comes from somewhere, not like he spawns directly on that spot. Beginning of scene. Go to that position. Now, then what we want is wait. No, we don't want it to wait. Never mind. Sorry. Then what we wanted to do to glide. Like, oh no, wait. Now we wanted to glide all the way to here. Oh, wrong button. All the way to like behind when he can't touch the V anymore. Like, a little bit more like that. Glide, not one second because that's too fast. So let's think. Two seconds could be good. I'm thinking about two seconds is good, yeah? Then, now if we check, it will go from there and we'll glide to the other side. But we wanted to repeat and go back to that. So if we put maybe forever, it's just a theory. It would, yeah, and look at that. It's going. But here's the thing. We can't die. Look, we just, it just goes through. And that's not good. So what we'll do if the, so green flag, uh, come on over here, green flag. Okay, green flag clicked. Then if touching color, now you don't have to be like scared, like, oh no, I don't know what the color is. I, we can't perfectly re recreate it, you can. Like here, like that. Now it knows, no wait, actually black, am I right? Because that's like more the real thing. If touching that color black, what we wanted to do is end the game, you're dead. So what we do is just go down and stop all, see that, stop all. Then stop all. So now, in theory, we stop. Oh, like see, it's not working. So that's why we forgot forever. We need forever in every single thing. So now forever, boom. We are dead. Like, yeah. So now if we press green flag again, we can now go over and jump over it and that's it thank you guys for watching this video please like and subscribe this was just part one so part two part three part four there will be much more better so that's why we did say it's a beginner thing you know what i mean just like easy thing jump over and next uh, episode what we'll do is a second spike that comes and then maybe like a block here and then you jump on the block and then like you go, go down. So that's what it's going to be in part two. Thank you guys for watching this video. Like and subscribe. Don't forget to believe in yourself. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.